We'll guide you through how to add an AI voiceover in CapCut. If you found this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. Firstly, either open an existing project or we can go and create a new one. So I'll click on new project and add this video here and press add. And I want to mute this video here as I'm adding the AI voiceover to it. So click on it, then scroll along and click on volume and you can turn it all the way down to zero and press the tick and it's now muted. So to go and add an AI voice, the best way to do it is to go and utilize text to speech. And then what we can do is either keep the text on the screen or you can just delete it and keep the voice. So go to the bottom and click on text like this, then click on add text and type in what you want the voiceover to say. So I could go and put in, hi, this is Guide Realm. Of course, you could make this longer or shorter. And if you want to keep the text on the screen, then what you can do is change the size of it by pinching it. And you can also go and change the font, the style, the effects. So yeah, if you want to keep it on the screen, you may want to put a little bit more effort into it. Once you're ready, go and click on the tick like so. And what you want to do is make sure the text is selected. It should automatically be. Then come to the bottom and click on text to speech. It will take you up to load the voices and you'll see some pro ones, which you do need to have the pro version for, but you can also go and see the free ones as well. So to go and hear what they sound like, just go and click on them. Hi, this is Guide Realm. And you can then go and hear how they sound. And if you like them, then you can go and press on the tick in the top right of the section and it will then go and generate it. And now if I play it back, Hi. you can go and hear that it's now playing. I'll pause it there though. And so what you can do is keep the text on the screen or if you want to go and delete the text and just have the voice, then simply click on the text and you can then click on delete. And if I play it, Hi, you can still hear that the voiceover is still there even without the text. You can then continue to edit or you can go and save your video.